I'm Anna. I'm Matteo. I'm Yannick. I'm Finn. I'm from Belgium. And we're going on a road trip. <laughs> Do you have someone uh, back in Germany as like a lover? Loki might be the best pupusa uh, that I have. That is crazy. It's the crab in the pool. Sergio? Okay. Sergio. Musto Gucho. So far, best country. And I've been here for three days. To MTV Cribs, baby. This is the living room. Dude, these bugs are killing me right now. <laughs> we, yeah, they're in my face. Ah, we black, we black, we black, we black. Hey, you say me? I don't want to see you eat it. This whole trip has been absolutely amazing. And honestly, I'm so proud of past Donald for just saying, yeah, we'll sign up for this amazing experience that we're about to have. Because four strangers, well, five strangers in one car driving through a foreign country stopping in random towns, sleeping on a farm, sleeping in a resort, going out, having a private beach, going to the beach, to me is just absolutely mind blowing. Welcome to day three of the El Salvador road trip with four random strangers. I met these people two days ago on a free walking tour and now I'm on a private resort with them having the best time of my life. Now today is a wild one. Last night was a wild one. Every single day of this trip has been a wild one when you're traveling with strangers and you're just renting a car, driving through a foreign country. But today, we say bye, because today is the last day. It turns out I did not wake up the earliest, because look, who's here? Uh, Mateo. Mateo's here at the pool, at one of the many pools here. And there is no one else here. Look, look, this. What's in the <gasps> A crab! That is crazy. It's the crab in the pool. Oh my <laughs> gosh. Look at that. Yeah, buddy, but look at the colors. Like purple, <sighs> black, so nice. Yeah, it's crazy. Can't tell if these houses are occupied with other tourists or people who live here. I think some houses here are actually like resident houses. The people who actually like live here, they sleep here, they probably work here. And they worked in this little city right down the road that I was at last night for the greatest pupusas that I have ever had. Good bath. It's good, the best. The best that I had since a while, I'm here. And then from there, they come back and they sleep here. They maintain the property. Right now, the tourism in El Salvador is pretty low. It still has a bad rap in the media, but I think this is the safest country, the best country. It has been the cheapest country out of Guatemala and El Salvador yet. And I heard even from the people that I'm staying with that it's cheaper than Nic Nicaragua and Honduras. And it uses the US dollar. So the math masks up every time. And then we have the beach. I'm really not much of a beach guy. I really didn't like the beaches in Mexico. I really don't like the beaches in America. But for some odd reason, this beach is really good. This, the sand is a little bit darker. It it's, uh, has a certain texture to it. I don't know how to describe it. Really good. The water, the water is not cold at all. It's like really warm and it feels great. Granted, that might be bad because of climate change, but hey, it is what it is. I'm just a man that posts videos on YouTube. I can't change that. The water is lovely here and it's pretty super clear. I don't know if this camera can really capture it, but it's amazing. It's lovely. I, I can see my feet, even though the sand is picked up from the waves. It's like I said, it's super flat. The waves here are incredible. And I'm not a beach guy like I keep on saying, I'm truly not. But I keep having these life-changing moments at the beach where I'm like, maybe I am a beach guy. Maybe this whole upcoming trip, this whole thing that I'm planning, I'm gonna chill every day at the beach. Waves here are kind of fierce. And that was not a fierce one.
Just head there like there and finish here. Yeah. It's really dangerous for this. Yeah, it's not the best, but. Crazy wave! Crazy wave! Woo! Oh, that's a whole lot of stuff right there. Hi, little. Watch out! And I was like, what? What's up? What? Watch out for what? You know? I was super confused. And then I think he said, I told you so. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was like, I was talking to you. I was like, are, are you sleep talking? What's going on? And you didn't reply. I was like, oh, she's really asleep. In, in English, she talked in English. Yeah, she talked in English. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know that they No, yeah, no worries. Sometimes I know that I sleep though. Bro, this bird wants to get in. No, bird. This is the house. You're a bird. Get out of here. Get out of here. You have to leave. Last road trip for a long time. Yeah, probably. Because I'm not going to do road trips in every country. <laughs> that doesn't make sense. Probably not, no. Might want to share one last Oreo with me if, I, if I'm never going to see y'all again. I want to take one photo of you. It all in It's possible. Una más. ¿Qué dices aquí? Como cheese, tequila. ¿Qué dices aquí? Gracias. Gracias. Una más. Okay. Uh, we can say pupusas. Pupusas. Gracias, gracias, gracias. Muchas gracias. Bueno, so, like, damn, stop it, guys, please. Yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to leave. She said, mm, sorry. You have to use the whole day. You have to use the whole day. Yeah, but I'd like to get to Antigua like, before it gets dark. So that's six hours. So it's an hour from here to the border where it can take a while. Oh, and then it's three hours by car to Antigua. So that's right. So you're going? Yeah, I'm gonna drop it off. Travel. Oh, okay. okay. And maybe like we can have, like Belgium and Germany is like really close. Well, I'll be there next year, girl. Yeah, yeah. 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 nice to meet you. Yeah. I will move. Have a good trip. Yeah. Well, you're you're yeah, yeah, yeah. Right now. yeah. Don't drink the best one of your life. If you're ever in Belgium, in one person. Mm. And you're in a party, huh? Uh huh. You're in a party, huh? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> oh, don't be sad. It was a nice road trip. Bye. 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 And there they go. Our first goodbye of the trip. Yeah, we're definitely. No chicken pass wants to pass. Yeah. <laughs> we're fucked. We were about to touch the bed. Damn dog. Yeah. The street. Have stopped in a little town and we are going to find some food. Uh, we are traveling with a vegetarian, so that does make some choices a little bit difficult. Oh, that's right, you're vegetarian. Uh, oh, we do have to watch out for that. I think we're walking to a pizza place. Oh, really? We just got out the car to walk. 
The road that we were on was a little bit sketch and bumpy to say the least. So to get out and stretch and stretch out our backs because that was a hard road. Yeah. Well, I wait for my pizza. Baden-Württemberg. <laughs> yeah. What? To me, that sounds made up. Baden-Württemberg. Yeah, y'all yeah, just like. Like in a fairy tale. Yeah, Baden-Württemberg. It's like, oh, y'all yeah, just said that randomly. Like, that's not a real place. Do you know those stickers where it's like they are yellow, like yellow and there's like written something? And Germans, in Germans always stick them on stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Why do y'all do that? That there's like written. It's nice here, but do, do you have ever been to Baden-Württemberg? It's like a joke, like a. It's meme. a joke, oh. and you put it like everywhere. <laughs> what does German sound like to you? Sound like? Baden-Württemberg. Yeah. Like the language. Also, wenn ich jetzt Deutsch spreche, how does oh. it sound for you? Gibberish. It's just straight gibberish. Yeah. What it's like means gibberish. Uh, nonsense. Yeah. Like it's like you're not saying real wor words. Quatsch. So. But is it like with other languages you don't understand the same? No, so I would not say that. So I would say in Spanish some words have some similarities to English. Oh yeah. Oh, and so okay. you could like hear that, you know, so you're like, oh they're oh they're talking yeah. about something, you know? Some something real, you know? Um, same thing with um, Italian, same thing with Portuguese, same thing with like other like languages, but I feel like German and then sometimes Russian too, which is two times for you, babe. <laughs> But I know Russian, but I like never use it because there's a fucking war. Yeah. Like it just really just sounds like you're not saying something real. Obviously it's real, right? But yeah, it's just yeah, like yeah, to I me, to my... I understand you like... My western ear, just like, y'all ain't like saying nothing real. Okay. That's so nice. What? Mmm. Why is it? pizza in El Salvador. Who would have thought? <laughs> mm -hmm. Tastes just like the Italians would make. Pizza in Salvador without any Salvadorian. Yeah. <laughs> nice. One thing I have left. Boom. Thank you, babe. Okay. Cucumba water instead of soda. What would you rate that pizza you just had? Mm, seven and a half of, out of ten. I thought my dough was good. So on my pepperoni pizza, I'm also going to give it like a seven. It's a pizza in El Salvador. What do you think, you know? But uh, uh, like I thought the bottom was really crispy, but not to the point where it's burnt, but a nice good oh, flake yes. on, on the bottom. Yeah, oh, so it was delicious. really fatty on the bottom and like really fatty on the top. It was good. Yeah, I liked it. After a short hike up a hill, we are now at the entrance to some waterfalls and it is raining on us. So we have to, dude, these bugs are killing me right now. <laughs> we, yeah, they're in my face. We have managed to find cover in the restaurant that is here while it rains. Bad news, it's been raining for a while. So we're gonna sit back, get some food. We just ate. But you can never have too much food in El Salvador and wet out this rain, but it's looking kind of rough. So if we have to walk, we have to walk. Oh man. I want a churros. Hello. Update, it has not slowed down the rain. The rain just keeps on coming, man. So I want to stop to, to rain to go to the Cascadas? I say yeah, and then if we get rained on, we get rained on. Shoes are off. Uh, we're gonna just decide to just go. Uh, she's gonna go too. Yeah, we're gonna get soaked. Yeah, our shoes are gonna get wet. That's why we're gonna take take off our, our shoes and our socks. But we're just gonna go see it. We've been wait, waiting for two hours now. We're gonna go. 
Oh. Oh. Okay. See, see. Oh. Okay. So we gotta go now. Uh, they close at five. Right? No, so we have time to go and. How? How? What's the time now? Four. This could be either the dumbest decision of this whole three-day trip or one of the smartest. We will find out. Oh, y'all are gonna give me a foot massage because we're walking in a trail barefoot, getting soaking rained on with bugs crawling all over us. And y'all think this is fun? No. Yep. <laughs> I'm having a real bad time right now. The dumbest decision of this whole three-day trip. I ain't gonna lie to you. Everybody else is powering through. They're Europeans. They know how to walk with their shoes off in the rain, I guess. <laughs> yeah. But this is what, you know, traveling's all about. Getting out your comfort zone and doing stuff that you would no, nev never normally do at home. And this is something that I would never do because why in the world would I walk through a forest in El Salvador, a foreign country, barefoot? It's absolutely insane. I have never been more grateful for shoes in my life. They were by 10, one of the most top inventions of the world. And they're for sure not in the top nine. It's pure rock and mud. And we're walking through it. Look how far they are. And I'm over here basically struggling to get by in the rain. It's kind of chaos. The dumbest decision of this whole three-day trip. But all that complaining aside, I think I make it because I hear a lot of water rushing and yeah, I made it. Wow. Oh, bro. Oh, you know, none too big. Me chilling by a waterfall. Wild. And unlike yesterday where we got in the waterfall, legend. Oh! This water is kind of uh, brown because it's taking all the dirt and because it's obviously raining. So uh, we're not going to get in it today, but it's still good to see. Woohoo! Great, so my man going crazy over there. All right, now what is he doing for real, for real? He's insane, guys. Mateo is not sane in the brain. Mateo, that is a weak tree, my guy. All right, we gotta say bye to this fabulous waterfall we have only been here for like 10 minutes but we are it's raining harder now if, if, if you can see and we're getting absolutely drenched from the rain and as well as the waterfall so uh let's uh, head out of here right let's, let's uh, go yeah. we got our pictures we got a video we can say we did it we did it and barefoot Whoa. craziest thing i've done a selfie? selfie yeah hey Anna. As it is getting colder and darker, I am regretting this decision to go to this waterfall and as well as barefoot. <sighs> I have to go now back up the same way I came with the terrain. It ain't that easy. And I'm cold because I'm soaked and we're going against gravity. Whew. 
I am. I am down bad. Down bad. I just got a leaf in my eye. I don't know if that's good or bad. Uh, actually, I do know. I think it's bad. The dumbest decision of this whole three day trip. Finally made it back to the restaurant. <laughs> And I don't know, guys. I don't know how I feel. How How do you feel? Completely dry. Okay. <laughs> how do you feel? <laughs> Jenny, how do you feel? Good. <laughs> Took a shower. That was a zero out of 10 experience. No. I would oh. never do that again. I honestly do not believe that there is a better time to have shoes on, on my feet. This just feels like I'm walking on clouds. This feels like, this feels like your first time going to school. This feels like your first time kissing a girl. The shoes are just different. Like, I know what this road feels like, cause I just did it. And now I don't know what this road feels like. And I am very happy. So kids, always wear protection and you'll be good to go. Right now, we're about to, uh, I believe, change clothes, and it's only 4.50, four, actually 4.57. About to change clothes, I found this little pavilion to, you know, not get rained on. And I don't know the car situation. We're soaked. Seats, cotton, soaked. We got to return the car today, so... Uh, Wish us luck. Just got in the car. Just no got done changing. And you know, and you remember those two little old ladies that were standing there? Uh, they got a free show from me, cause I changed. <laughs> and now we have an hour drive back to where we need to go. And it's raining bad, and we can't see a thing. You want me to wipe my? Yeah. Yeah, I got you. You can't see nothing out here. <laughs> and, like, and like the brakes are so mushy oh. that like it doesn't even matter. Oh. <laughs> it's the fastest I can go. I can't tell you. I can't tell you. Yeah, don't go too fast. Yeah. You can't see those things. Mach die Scheibenwischer schneller. Das geht nicht schneller. What? What? Whoa. Whoa. Oh, what's that? On the road again. Can't wait to see you on the road again. I don't even know that song, man. I'm surprised that you know it, yeah. Yeah, it's just some country. <laughs> oh, man, what a drive, what a drive, what a drive, bro. What a trip, it was really nice. We are dropping off at our respective hostels, and then we're gonna go to something to eat, and we're gonna go get a car. This hostel, or this room, is in the back of a little corner store, like a tienda. Crazy. So imagine you just wake up, you know, at night saying, hey, I need a snack. <laughs> Walk up out your thing and go get a snack real quick. It just makes sense. Are we in a mall right now? I miss it a bit. This is a mall. Dude, this is like one of my first times in a mall in a while, like stateside. Like, I never, like, am in malls. I know this is very childish of me, but I just wanted to ride on escalator because I wanted just to feel something, you know? I haven't rode on escalator in a couple couple weeks, even, I want to say, a couple months. So just to get a nice use of the elevator feels pretty good for the use of the escalator. And I'm now, I'm gonna go right back down. Wow, this food court has a bunch of American brands. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Got Panda Express, GN, uh-oh, GNC, Wendy's, Papa John, Subway, Pizza Hut, Burger King, McDonald's, Taco Bell, what else? 
and Food Express. We ended up getting China Wong, not an American company. Well, as far as I know, well, I never had it. And I'm gonna get, take out my first bite. Very cold, very cold. The chicken. Also, very cold. Mm. It is what it is. It's the end of the day. Yeah. They close at like 8.30. It's 8.11. You can't be mad. Right? I see a company that I haven't seen before in a minute. Wow. Well, look at this. Radio Shack. There's a Radio Shack. I could have swore they went out of business. Yeah, I want to eat I don't want to do it because I'm going to cry. <laughs> me? <laughs> me, me, me. I know I'm too little for this. Huh? They're like nearly the same. Like, I think one centimeter less than... Boo, no, I'm taller. Okay, I'm... You have to like go, go back by back. Am I taller? Yeah, I'm too sorry, bitch. <laughs> You're like 175 ish? Ish? And my ID is 176. Oh, okay. So they lied. Currently trying to um, return the car, but there's a couple of scratches on it that we have made. Now, I have not made it, but we as a group, we as a group have made it. And so I'm gonna let them deal with that. While I look at this beautiful street, it's kind of nice. It's very quiet, it's chill. We just got done talking to this man that came up to us. He said Germany is his favorite country to learn about history from. Um, okay. See? I'm Anna, and I'm from Germany. See. Uh, yeah, like, what do you, like, do you have someone uh, back in Germany as like a lover. Que es? Es, es un fiesta. No. No? The people uh, here in the house uh, is there. Hey. Dude, look at this horse. Look at this horse. <laughs> this thing is huge. Oh yeah, yeah, this dog seems like a good dog. He, he gets treated well. He's, he's a tad bit skinny. But no, it's, I think it's healthy. Yeah, that plus his like plus his size is like kind of kind of good Look at like his that. Balls, please. Yeah, but like, his balls, yeah. Look at this. I'm not, I'm not looking at the dog balls. <laughs> I'm not looking at the dog balls. <laughs> While they deal with that, today was a good day, right? We saw like huge dog balls. Okay, God <laughs> damn it. So. I think Hannah and I just be walking in the wrong direction. Yeah, we We've been walking for like. We passed this, but like two four modules. Since we when? Have. Since the supermarket? No, since we turned. Okay. Well, let's go back. Well, back, let's go. I mean, your direction is this one. Oh, our direction. Our direction is this yeah. way. Hopefin is good in Antigua. We have to take her. Uh, yeah, yeah, she, she, she just say something. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, she said something. She said just uh, like, I mean, I run five thirties. The trip was pretty easy. Or no. Yeah. Yeah, good for her. Okay. Alright, but then maybe we we'll see each other tomorrow. Yeah, uh, yeah. maybe, but and if, if not, if not, this is my last time. Yeah. Bye, babe. Nice, nice to yeah, meet you. Yeah, 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 for sure. Yeah, um, Nicaragua. I just like get out the way. Bye, bye bud. See you then. Yeah. 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 Hell yeah, yeah. bud. Okay. If not, yeah, yeah, later, yeah. but yeah. Yeah. All right, guys. Yeah, Bye, guys. guys. Bye. Hopefully, yeah. see you now. But if not, it was it was a three fun days. Yeah, yeah. I think so too, man. Three fun yeah. days. Bye, guys. Bye. And then there were just two so of us. We going party. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 we're gonna be chilling tonight, but we're gonna be chilling.